straight again. Unusual, did this aged merchant have something? Have a safe journey.
Hello? Is someone there? My name is Hayata. And I'm journeying in search of the distant light. If I might be so bold as to ask, would you donate any Shabriri grapes in your possession to me? My eyesight has been weak since birth, you see. I can't tell which way I'm supposed to go next. But when I eat one of those grapes, I can feel a distant light in the back of my eyes. It will lead me to my true duty as a finger maiden. Hello? Would you donate any of them on a pilgrim and when I eat one of Until it was shattered, the tragic corruption of the Order has taken its toll. Across the realm, life lies in ruin, fallen to pieces. Foul curses and misery spread, unabating. But the greater will has not abandoned the realm, nor the life that inhabits it. So it is that the tarnished are guided by grace. Called to act, brave tarnished. Your great rune is a handsome shard of the Elden Ring. Seek another of its kind. To become Elden Lord and restore the Golden Order. Let the words of the fingers guide you. Well, a remembrance of gold has found its way into your possession. Demigods and even the crater of the champions are hewn by the earth tree upon their end into remembrances. They are Valuable indeed. These remembrances yet house the power of their former masters. And should you wish to wield that same power, well, I will lend you the strength of the fingers. Oh, do not recoil from my offer. The fingers guide us all. And you, Tarnished, you are here to take, are you not? Ah, great runes are the stuff of demigods. The children of the goddess, Queen Marika. She who is vessel of the Elden Ring. Tainted by the strength of their runes, her children warred, but none could become Elden Lord. And so grace was extended to your kind, the tarnished. Listen, the fingers speak. The greater will has long renounced the demigods. Tarnished. Show no mercy. Have their heads. Take all they have left. Indeed. 
But remember one thing. The demigods are each and all the direct offspring of Queen Marika. Godric the Grafted was but a distant relation, the runt of the litter. His divine blood sorely diluted. Greetings. My name is Roderica. I should have told you sooner. Isn't this place impressive, though? The round table hold. Covert quarters of the two fingers. And gathering place of champions who vie to become Elden Lord. I never knew the guidance bestowed upon us tarnished had such fantastic roots. Although, it's all a bit much for me, in truth. I'm still looking for my own purpose. It's all a bit much for me. I'm still looking. Now, those eyes tell a story of a challenger who's failed her vine and well. Now, lay out. to see you. Thank goodness you're safe. I'm still looking for my own purpose. It's not easy by any means, but it's what I must do. You're telling me I possess some kind of gift? I don't believe you. But if I do have this talent, and goodness knows it would be my first, I suppose I should try to hone it, shouldn't I? I'll ask Master Hugh to teach me. Certainly he does appear intimidating and holds no love for us tarnished. But I know he's trapped here at the round table hold. So, I can tell. He's a gentle soul underneath it all. If I do have a talent for spirit tuning, then goodness knows that would be a surprise. I suppose I should try to hone it, shouldn't I? I'll ask Master Hugh to teach me. Oh, your divinity have mercy and grant me forgiveness. The road is yet long, a god is not easily felled. But one day without fail you will have your wish. Huh. You, is it? I didn't notice you there. I'll be doing my job, same as ever. Just lay out your arms. Those words were not meant for you. I may be prisoner to you, tarnished lot, but my prayers are mine, and mine alone. Well, I've had my say. I'll be more careful, too. 
Back already. No matter. The girl. What about her? Are you out of your mind? Who'd stay with an ugly brute who only knows how to smith? Absurd. Besides, she'd never agree to it. I refuse to believe it. I don't doubt you, but I know when something's too good to be true. Good to see you again. Thank you very much. I have you to thank, don't I? For persuading Master Hugh. I can happily announce that he has taught me the noble toil of spirit tuning. I'm as yet unsure of what I might be able to accomplish, but if I might be able to help you all, I'd certainly like to try. And if there's any chance to ease the suffering of my dear men who were grafted, well, I certainly must try. Roderica, the spirit tune apprentice. Pleased to make your acquaintance. Well, I took you for dead. No matter, it's all the same. Lay out your arms then. I spoke with the girl. She has a gift for spirit tuning. So I told her everything I know. I'm indebted to a spirit tuner I met long ago. It was all I could do to honor her. I'm sorry I doubted you. Receive the wisdom of the two fingers, have you not? Then I bid you welcome, as a true member of the round table. I am known as Gideon Ofnir, as a tarnished who wishes to stand before the Elden Ring and become Elden Lord. I am accumulating knowledge, to be all-knowing. You now belong to a select group of fellows. As such, I ask that you remain constant. You'll be after more great runes now, eh? Then as your fellow, allow me to divulge a little knowledge. The inheritors of the great runes, the shard bearers. We of the round table know the location of five of them, including the one you defeated. Godric the Grafted, Lord of Stormvale. General Radan, who fought Melania and her rot to a standstill in the Caelid Wilds. Praetor Rykard, Lord of the Volcano Manor of Mount Gelmir. Morgoth, the Grace Given. Veiled Monarch and Lord of Lame Dell. And Renala, Queen of the Full Moon. Ruler of Rhea Lucaria's Academy. You'll still be after more great runes, won't you? So, Godric the Grafted, Lord of Stormvale. Despite being the blood of Godfrey, First Elden Lord, He's a grotesque old fool, grasping for power. His castle lies upon the cliff to Limgrave's northwest, but I suspect you know that well enough already.
You're tarnished, aren't you? Then perhaps you could spare some runes. Believe it or not, I studied Blindstone Source for a small donation. I'd be happy to share my knowledge. Well, bless you, bless you. You're a true sin. My name is Tobes. Presuming you're interested, I can teach you sorceries, as promised. Only, none of them are particularly great. Apologies, friend. I'm afraid my meager sorceries are no match for your generosity. Oh, right. I can tell you what I know about this place. That should help a bit. You've seen that structure to the north, towering over the water. That's the Academy of Rhea Lucaria, where we study glintstone sorceries. Only its doors have been closed for quite some time now. After they declared they wouldn't interfere with the shattering, the Academy cast repelling seals on the east gate leading to the capital, and the south gate leading here. As you might have guessed, the seals are still active, making entry to the Academy impossible without a glintstone key. And so I'm stuck here. A fledgling sorcerer, with little chance of acquiring a key. When they cast the seals, I'd just popped out. And now I'm uprooted from my place of learning. Why not find yourself a glintstone key? Without one, you can't pass through the academy. And you'll never reach the Erdtree capital. And if you find an extra glintstone key, perhaps, once you've tied up all your loose ends. And I can be very patient. Would you consider donating it to me? I know it. I'm a blunt stone. Merely a hint of talent or sorcery. But still, my place is at the Academy. Your new and surprised you found me in my little nook. No matter, no matter. Your money's as good as anyone else's. Why don't you take a look at my wares? Oh, but don't ask me how I got my hands on them, eh?
Ah, not every... 